PTV presents G4 PTV's Funny Signs Episode 12, The Aftermath. Update, we were originally going to show the aftermath of Flower's death in Universal Television Logo Bloopers 211, but there was a change of plan. We decided to show in Funny Signs instead, which pretty much means that our storylines will be connected to other text-to-speech shows. We hope you all enjoy this video. Michael? What's wrong? It's Flower. She's dead. She's what? But it can't be. She died during surgery. They did everything they could save her. Oh, my darling. I am so sorry. How's John? Not so good. He's struggling to cope with the aftermath. They're there. Michael, I'll take you back to the apartment to calm down. So, how did it go? Is Flower going to make it? Actually, I'm afraid she didn't. John told me that Flower is dead. Oh no. Yup, John is absolutely devastated. How can this happen? She can't be dead. We've been married for a year and I've lost her. This is not fair. I agree, John. Do you want me to take you back to the ward? I'll be fine, okay? We just found out about Flower. We're sorry. We'd never seen the day you lost the woman of your life. The doctors, nurses, and surgeons did everything they could, but there was nothing they can do for her. We're sorry. Are you now? I thought you could save Flower. Michael made his wish that Flower could recover, and you granted it. And now look what happened. She's dead. It's all your fault. John, stop it. You can't blame the genie for Flower's death. It's not his fault. The hospital failed to save Flower. They killed the only woman I ever had in my life. Nurse, let's take you back to your ward, okay? Hey, Soup, what's happened? It's Flower. She's gone. Gone? Where? She's dead. I know, I only just found out from Michael. She was my friend. How can anyone kill her like that? Why not should I take you to Geronimo's flat? I'll take care of you. <laughs> All right, we made it back to the studio for the first time since after the shooting. I still can't believe that flower is dead. If evil G4 Pete or his two criminal partners in law wouldn't start in that siege, she would still be alive. You're right, Michael. But you know what they say, life goes on. We will read some funny signs while the cemetery is preparing Flower's funeral. Are you sure, Michael? Don't you think it's appropriate to read signs after everything that has happened? Let's just get on with the funny signs, okay? Unless you want me to throw a tantrum. Okay, okay, okay. If you insist. Sign request by Could you just keep it down there? We just lost someone we loved. Flower Anderson. She's dead? Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. I didn't even realize there was a hostage situation here. That's okay, RoboSoft3. And as Michael said, let's get on with it. No running in the halls. Detention for you. But why can't I run in the hallway? It's fun. Is it? Cover is praying for snow. Please stop. How can it be snowing in June? It's summer. Yes. Sun, heat was and all. We only have winter during June in some parts of the world like Australia, New Zealand, or probably Brazil. Microsoft Sam is going to get kidnapped? Oh no he won't. He's on a honeymoon with Anna and I doubt that would happen. You're right, 2DCH. And please don't get us started about the evil beings going on about dismissing her claims. Evil will always fail! Introducing Petra from Minecraft Story Mode. Thanks, but... Okay, seriously, why are we even reading this? Can you please do not read the sign? Too late, I just read that sign. Pedro Silva, you are under arrest. For reading that sign? Sheesh. Shark, 
Later, after Pedro paid a $500 fine for reading a sign that warned him not to read. Swearing is allowed. I don't think it's allowed, because G4PTV is supposed to be a family-friendly channel. Although we used to have swearing in the past. Actually, I did cuss in UTLB 210. Of course, I did not know what else I had to say. So are we either allowed to swear or not? Let's just keep this channel family-friendly, okay? I'll try, but hey, freedom of speech! Understood. Duty. Hello, Shrap. It's me, Geronimo. Do you know anything about this guy, called Rufus Henderson? He was the guy that masterminded the hostage situation at Logo ID Studios. There's something I have to do. Do you know how I can access his bank account? Okay, thanks for telling me. Bye. So, is he awake or not? I don't know, Selim. He's still in a coma, but I don't think he'll ever respond. But he will, Rhonda. We'll just have to wait. That's all. When G4P wakes up, we can go spend a summer vacation in the Maldives. It's what he always wanted. I wish I was there. I live never visited to a chocolate island before. Neither have I. Who? What? Where am I? He's alive! G4P, you're up. Thank God. I was so worried about you. I thought I was dead. I almost got killed. Yeah, I agree. You nearly got killed by evil G4P. And also, another attacker. Wait, who are you talking about? I assume that someone else is trying to finish G4P off, but we can't figure out who it was. So who was the one that shot G4P? I wish I'd known, but I don't. It could be anyone. Well, we have to look for clues. It could be anyone. Like Rufus, the Prince of Darkness, or someone else. Wait. What has Satan got to do with him? Because I believe that he wanted G4P dead for so long. I think he was the one that shot G4P. I don't know that yet, Wanda. He's not even a real subpet. She's right. We have to gather more evidence. But that's the least of your worries at the moment. I'm up, alive and well. But thanks for being there for me. You're welcome, G4P. Transfer complete. Gotcha. And now, back to the signs. Oh, wait. We've run out of sign requests. Those thinker. I guess we'll just have to move on with the regular signs then. Feeling a bit paranoid? Remember, you are not alone. Am I hallucinating or what? Laughter is the best medicine. Unless you have diarrhea. Not even laughter cures diarrhea. That's what happened with Sam after he ate at Taco Bell. For the 7,432nd time this year. What, mate? Thanks for visiting. Come back when you can stay longer. Huh? Deep fried Kool-Aid. So they have a fried Kool-Aid now? Oh yeah! <laughs> Actually, I don't think it's the best time to make jokes right now. We're still mourning flour. Sorry! Customer is king. King never bargains. How intelligent of him. What an OP customer. Great escape preschool. I have no idea what this is, but it makes no sense! This must be where all the little kids escaped preschool. They all want to be like Captain Virgil Hiltz. This light never turns green. How much sense does that make out of this sign? What would you do if there was a traffic jam and a traffic light doesn't go green? Well, nothing. We just stay in the car forever. I don't get it. Google is wrong. This is not an actual road. Then, if this is not a road, what is it? The countryside, what else? 
Please don't visit the hospital if you're unwell. How can we not go to the hospital if we're not well? That's stupid. Dang right it is stupid. This is the meanest hospital in the world. Or we can switch to another one. Hey, can I come at a bad time? Not at all, Geronimo. What's up? I just came to tell you that I got good news. G4P has woken up from a coma and he is quickly recovering thanks to his strong pain relief treatment. Phew! Thank goodness! Uh, well, thank god he's gonna make it after all. Yeah, and I was wondering if I could stay here in Logo ID Studios permanently since Flower Anderson died. I can fill in for her spot. That is a good idea, Geronimo. Welcome back to the studio. Thanks, Michael. I'm back where I belong. Now let's see what's next. In loving memory of Sri Fridge Cookerney. 1854 to 2022. Rest in pieces. So these people put up that sign about a very old fridge dying? What kind of people would do that? Rest in peace, Fridgeish. You will be missed. Anyways, now that we've run out of time, let's all go out to lunch. But wait. Before we do that, I just got a letter from the Los Gala Mayor. What, what did he say, Joshua? He says that we are invited to celebrate the 10th anniversary of UTLB in Los Gullum. What? We're holding an anniversary party for UTLB this soon? But the celebration party doesn't begin until February 2024. There was a change of plan due to the reconstruction of the same street this studio is located at right now. This studio we are at right now is getting renovated, and it will have a new indoor background. So we're going to use a 2DCH one or just a colorful and vibrant one? We'll see, Michael. But anyway, let's dine for lunch. Thanks for calling me back, Trap. I transferred Rufus's money to my bank account. Thanks for helping me out. Bye. Oh, sorry, Michael. I was just busy with you. Where is my money? What have you done with it? It's none of your business. You have stolen my money. I know you did. What did you expect? A payback? Especially after what you did with Flower? You killed her. No, I did not. Evil G4P did. He's even going to trial, thanks to you. Where's all this coming from, huh? Do you really think it's my fault that evil G4P is going to trial? You manipulated him and Hades thanks to your Norbuck and Nine Skip nonsense. You're even breaking into my house just so you could track me and my mafia down. But guess what? I won't let you. What do you think you're doing? Put that gun down! Why? Are you scared? Are you scared about what I would do? Look, could you just let me explain? Explain what? About what a traitor you are. If you don't give back my money, I will make you and your family disappear. Understood? To be continued on PBS Bloopers 15. This video was part of G4P TV Super Saturdays. Super Saturdays, the perfect way to kick off the weekend.